Maybe this will work, and then we can actually take off better. Oh no, it's it's sliding. I think that worked though. No, no, that didn't work. Oh. <laughs> All right, hey everybody, this is Jared Four Four here, and today I'm playing this game called Simple Planes. Um, might look like it's not the best kind of game, but actually it's pretty good. Um. Thanks to the developers at Jundru, um, the makers of this game, um, I was able to get a key um, so I can make this video and record it for you guys. Uh, in this game, pretty much, there's these. They're all races you can do against the computer. Tutorials, pretty much, in this. Building, ground school, weapons, landing and takeoff. Um, then there's combat one training and missions stuff like that uh, bridge demolition dogfights those are the things then challenges which these ones are actually pretty fun I like these ones and then my all-time favorite is a sandbox mode you can build your own planes fly them around uh, shoot stuff since there's weapons um, dogfight which you go against computer in a t like with weapons then race against it you just I think there's a track that you can do and then download planes which is honestly my favorite thing about this whole thing is because you guys might not be able to see this but uh it pulls up a uh it pulls up the steam GUI with a website that has with the website that has all the uh vehicles and I'll give an example of this with a plane I'll down, uh download it and all you do is you click on the one you want and then it'll just do this and it'll pull it up and we'll go we'll go test this too and this is what it looks like in game but this is what this one looks like and uh... it's um... i forgot what it's called but it's it's like a stealth plane stealth bomber type thing i like the design of this cause you can uh... oh jesus it's tipping over you can barely see it and it actually like folds in so it it actually looks like it's just a, the wheels were on a plate just as thin as this the, the actual controls the what's it called handling on this thing is actually pretty well it turns really fast but you can't really do like barrels it, instead of holy crap <laughs> no no I'm going down now I'm like a frisbee. I'm a frisbee, mom. Look. Look, mom. I'm a frisbee. I don't think these do anything on this plane. Maybe if we put the landing gear down. That didn't work. Alright. And you can click restart and just try again. But uh, I'm going to move on. To, I think what I'm going to show you guys is actually a build file. I'm going to try to build my own plane. So we're going to. Um, let's do new. So this is the cockpit that we have. Um, I think what I'm going to do. What you have is actually like the structure itself of everything. Then you got the wings, propulsion, such as like propellers and jets and also a uh, vertical takeoff uh, you got landing gear some retractable ones then you got gizmos there's cameras detachers um, rotators air brakes which are pretty cool I like those honestly um, this is my favorite part because there's all these different type of weapons um, different rockets rocket pods mini guns like I wouldn't call them nukes, but they're like pretty much like they're just bombs. That's what I'm gonna call them. Then uh, there's different type of cockpits that you can do. Um, I'm gonna go out, go with a like a what's it called? Just a, a basic type design. And I'm gonna just 
make it nice and basic as a normal plane would be. Make it like that long with this. And what we can do is this propulsion. Now it's on propulsion wings. No, it's in structural. Take primary ring, wing, ring, wing here, and uh, you can also do this. Uh, change the size and of what and everything of what you want your plane to be. And what's a really awesome thing about this is I think it's this button. Yeah, and you can mirror it so you don't have to like worry about measurements or anything messing up. Then we'll go here, grab this. Let's see, where do I want to, I'm going to do this. Got a propulsion, and I'll choose, I'm going to choose this for my engine. And we'll put these on the side. And I'm going to put some wheels right here um, do these ones maybe move these closer or something to the edge right there whoops and then what we can do is this go here mirror it so that on the other side, no, this one. This is what I meant to mirror. There. And then what we'll do is go to, let's see here. We'll get some of these. Honestly, I don't know what a pylon is. I'm going to take these off and just put the vertical stabilizer up here. Put a horizontal stabilizer there. Whoops. Then we're going to... Not what I wanted. Okay. And that. Then we gotta get some landing gear. Rear. And I think that's it for now. I am going to actually let's do this. Let's add some weapons. We're gonna add mini guns to the side. Like that. Oh, you know what I realized? This might not actually work. There might be too much weight on the front. We'll do this. There might still be too much weight, but we'll see. Then we can get some rocket pods. Maybe we can put these on the wings. Or maybe not. I know we can put these ones pretty sure on the wings if you gotta like it's kinda confusing ah whatever we'll we'll go with this and see if we can fly it let's see if it nope too much weight just what I thought uh, we need to put a wheel on the front that's not right Got to get a block first, and then we'll get the landing gear. Then we can set this all up. Now that's too big. That's fine. We'll do that. So we'll start it up. Mini guns work. Uh, can't. Okay, we got lift off. Put up our landing gear. Whoa, these wing ones are cooler. I just get a longer. 
So what it looks like is it's actually, um, I can't control going down. It's kind of bad in that range. It's not the best. Oh, that didn't work. Um, I see a boat out there. I might try to go over to that. But I'm going to try to figure out how I can fix this and see. I'm going to see if I can. Ooh, colors. I'm going to do this one for now. Maybe if we just take these off for now. Might help, and then I'll move these there, and there. Maybe that'll work. Maybe this will work, and then we can actually take off better. Oh no, it's it's sliding. I think that worked though. No, no, that didn't work. Oh. <laughs> I am going I'm gonna show you guys some of these aircraft these are the preloaded ones that you get um, let's do this one this one's honestly my favorite because it has so much like w so many weapons on it I think five is for the bombs so I'll show you guys that one uh, yeah that Let's try that again. And uh, what you actually can do is that's a, there's a minigun on the front, but as you can see, they like glide through the air, and you'll see right about now. Oh no, they fell down the hill. But yeah, I like the explosion animations, honestly. But this game is currently in. Um, well, so it was on the green light thing on Steam, if you guys know about that. Um, and it ended up getting greenlit, so this game releases tomorrow. Don't exactly know what time, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be in pre-alpha, pre-beta phase, or in one of those phases um, before it's actually fully ready. But what I'm hoping is they'll keep releasing updates for this game and uh add more stuff one thing i may want might want them to add is probably like a multiplayer online co-op type thing or go against each other It'd be pretty fun to do that but i'm gonna i'm gonna show you one of my actually yeah let's see if i can find it pig pen i think this yeah this has missiles where to go some interesting names for a lot of these. I think I may have messed that wing up. Definitely did. Gotta fix that. Or else this thing's not even gonna fly. There we go. And I feel like yeah, I knew it. I knew this. There had to be a reason that it was like that. But this one, I don't know what it's going to do like that. That actually kind of looks cool. It's like a, it's like ultimate attack mode. It's, it's going to get you. Then you can do this. And I like this one because I think it goes faster this way. I think if we press this button, we'll drop those bombs. Press two, three... Wait, are they, I don't think those are bombs, actually. Wait, they're still falling. Still falling. Yeah, there's a small explosion. But you can also do this, which is really funny. You can press... Oh, none, never mind. None of those actually worked. I was expecting that to... Uh, um, to drop those white ones. I thought I could drop those. I guess not. Uh, this one doesn't have the 
machine gun on it. It only has rockets and bombs. But I'm actually going to try to find that ship that I was talking about before. But honestly, I like how... It, is, it doesn't look like they put too much work into this. It kind of stretched, but they'll probably add a new map or uh, update to the map to make it more stuff. But it's pretty wide range, so it's not like you're going to crash into some random invisible object as far as I know. But so far, there's not a ton to do in Sandbox, just to test out your ships and stuff, or your <laughs> ships, jets and planes and all that stuff that you want to do. But if you guys do want to check this game out, I'll put a link down to the Steam page, the uh, store page, and their uh, website where you can buy the game for mobile, Mac, and PC with the iPhone 2, I think. Um, but I see that I see that ship over there, so I'm gonna actually I want to go in attack mode, ultimate transformer. Oh, I need to pull. I need to pull back up. I'll have to try to get back on. I'm gonna try to land on that. No, still up, still up, still up. Not anymore. Rip. But I'm gonna show you guys some of the uh, downloadable planes. Um, some more of them, and uh, this one is called Thrust SSC. I think that this is the one that um, achieved the 763 uh, world's fastest, I'm pretty sure. And actually, tell on this one, it looks like it's all like technical and stuff. And uh, But we're gonna start off like this. Thing's insanely loud. So I'm gonna zoom out. We're gonna try to get as fast as we can. See how fast it can go. This thing can probably fly a little since of how, because of how fast it's probably going to go. Um, it doesn't look like it's going to reach 700, though. It's going to reach 600 before hitting the water, that's for sure. I have the best idea. I'm going to put some uh, wings on this thing. Probably uh, horizontal stabilizers. And see if I can get this to fly at least a little. Let's put that there. Maybe that there. There and there. And maybe I will be able to like pull up because it'll be, it's going to be like that. So let's zoom out a little so you don't you guys aren't blowing your eardrums out with the jets like I am. And the sound's not even that high up either. Jeez. So it's definitely pulling up a little when I uh, push up, it's probably going to just be able to glide. Yeah, definitely can't fly. Maybe if we put on some real wings and put on primary wings. Take these off. And then we'll keep, we'll actually keep those back stabilizers on. Let's hope this works, because I want to see if I can... I might not be able to, though. Yeah, because it's not taking off here, and usually you would think it would take off by now. It's sort of flying, definitely better, but it didn't go as far as I wanted it to. Maybe put, let's try one more thing. We'll put we'll do this. We'll put a vertical stabilizer up here. And then we'll put another horizontal one right there and then mirror it. Maybe then it can pull up. I like how they did these engines, though. Oh, that's loud. 
But I like how they did them because they covered them so it doesn't, it's not just a regular default engine look. They have like a custom design on it. It's nice. No, it doesn't pull up, that's for sure, but I can sure do like barrel rolls. <laughs> Uh, let's let's look for another one. Maybe find. All right, so we got this one. It's called the Gold Warby. Uh, this thing's actually pretty nice, dude. I like this thing. They said uh, that it doesn't have any weapons yet, but it look. I thought that's what these things are. I guess not. The jets are here, and I'm pretty sure there's some there, maybe. I like the look of this one. This one's actually pretty cool. Definitely doesn't have any weapons. That's for sure. But I don't know what this does. This might... Oh, that's what... I honestly still don't know what that does, but it's flipping out now. It's like a, it's kind of like a bumblebee. Not really, but that's what I see it as. Alright, for the last one I'm going to show you guys today, it's uh, called the multi-roll uh, helicopter, something like that. Amazing. I love the look of this. Oh, it actually spins. Oh, because it's an actual propeller that I see. Oh, we got the camera here, and this is how you control it. So, I don't think this actually works, um, like as a... Yeah, as an actual, like, thing. But I'm pretty sure the, uh, maker of this is... Once, once they make a... Like, different, um... Updates or stuff like that, he might actually... I wouldn't be surprised if he... Um, if he ended up making it so this could work, that'd be really cool. But, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Mm -hmm.